because he chose the world over God, because he shifted his focus off Christ, now he's being convicted, now he's being compromising in his beliefs to protect his people. Now not only is he going into battle, but he says now he will have to stay here and serve me forever. You and your men will be my personal bodyguard. So now he's having to be the personal bodyguard of a man that he's supposed to defeat, who is going after his own people. Now he's being convicted. Now he's compromising his convictions. And when we think about this, the choices that we have in this life, they matter. I teach this to my son every day. Son, the choices that you make, they have consequences. And there is no consequence worse than when we choose to go against what Christ is calling us to do. There is no consequence worse than when we take our focus off of Christ and put it on ourselves. And David does this a lot. But what he also does, and what I also saw, is whenever, what's your face, Abigail came to David and he, she stopped this man from killing her husband. And what spoke to me in that phrase was, it's never too late. It is never too late to turn back to Christ. It does not matter how many steps you get away from him. It only takes one in the opposite direction to get back. David does this numerous times. He could have killed Saul three times. 